Hello everyone and welcome back to Ty Pennington's Holiday Special Extreme Makeover Ho Ho Home Edition. Rudolph family moved that bus 32 in the last episode. God damn, um, we actually came back to later worlds, or earlier worlds rather, to fucking get some, uh, stuff that we haven't seen before. And, uh, looks like we're at the right spot because this- oh Jesus Christ. <laughs> there's, uh, there's some green bananas here for ya boy, Chunkus Donkus. So, uh... You know, if there's even single singular bananas, I will get them. Espe especially, god damn it, if we don't have all of the, uh, the, or if we don't have the banana metal. Who do we have the banana metal for here, by the way? Also, how many banana metals in total do we have? I'm curious. Uh, actually, it's just Diddy and Donkey, which makes sense. Oh my god, Donkey's so close to getting a banana metal here, god damn. Okay, but actually, how, how, uh... How? Uh, yeah, totals. Can I see how many banana medals we have total? I almost need to stop worrying about bananas now. Like, of course I'm gonna collect the bananas if I see them in a world, for God's sakes. But like, woo, 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 doggy boys. <laughs> I'm almost there. God damn it. The long jump is good, but I think I should start using a normal jump and um and uh, midair j uh, attack. Cause that's what you guys have been trying to get me to do. That makes sense. I'm not sure if you guys can answer which one covers more ground. Probably that, actually. That seems like it covers a lot of ground. Um, I've ran out of singular bananas on this trail, goddammit. But I'm willing to take ya boy. Oh, hey. <laughs> Even more singular bananas. That's awesome. Uh, Snide's HQ is kind of useless for me right now. I don't need you, Snide. Love ya, but I don't need ya at, the very, at this very moment in time. <coughs> Oh my god, that's awesome. The, uh, the midair attack, sure, it gets you distance and stuff, but it's also really freaking fun to use for its actual practical purpose. Yeah, there's nothing back here for Chunks. <laughs> Chunks McDunks. He's actually a very good basketball player. Not a lot of people know this. He just never wanted to be chosen to play basketball. Um, makes sense. The poor boy. He's kinda, he's, he's a little scaredy cat, but god damn it. He's more of a scaredy monkey. <laughs> okay, fuck. <laughs> God damn it. It's not even worth it. There was probably nothing up there. It's fine. <laughs> Sup? How you doing? Chunks McDunks here. Oh my god. Actually, you know what? After I left this world, you guys were telling me that the best way to traverse the landscape in this world is the trees. I should definitely climb more trees in this world. Um, it just makes sense to do so. I really doubt that 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 uh that tactic is gonna get me over there but I, if this t if the jump midair attack tactic gets me over here i will swear by it for the rest of the let's play <laughs> well it's foreboding considering uh i can't even fucking stay on top of a tree oh my god <gasps> like the long jump would not make that by any stretch of the imagine okay okay i like it oh jesus also why did i even come back over here yet god damn it i didn't have to there's um there's something up here for uh lanky so i might as well do that real quick does um does everybody's mid-air attack work that good i hope so man wait hold on hold on there's immediately something that i see for chunkus it's just coins but god damn it one day we might need them can you still grab Oh my god, okay, I love this. <laughs> you guys have been telling me to do the midair attack for so long. And like, I can see why now. Also, I'm gonna have to go backwards on this because I missed the first one. <laughs> well, <laughs> god damn it. Excuse me, sir, just coming through. I should really grab that friggin' watermelon, but hey, whatever. Uh, are you still after me? It sounds like it. I'm not too concerned, though. Sup, dude. That is awesome. God damn it. All right. I'm getting, uh, getting okay with this. You know, okay being, uh, the frickin' mid-air attack. Nothing else, apparently, gosh darn it. Gizzity gosh darn it. If I, uh, if I switch to Lanky, like, there's actually some nerners up in some trees over here. Um, you, what I really appreciate about this game is that even though some of the collectibles are for other Kongs, they're still, um, translucent. Which is really nice, because if they weren't, I wouldn't be able to even collect anything. Because, like, 90% of the stuff that I know how to go to and collect is because I've seen it as another Kong. So, um, there is actually, 
something I know how to do as Chunky. I think Chunky's the only one left um, to do this specific thing. But there is a um, there's a temple that has uh, Chunky pineapples to shoot on the the goddamn the temple wall, and it'll give me a golden banana, I think. Oh, hey, look at this. Okay. Oh, look at this, he says while falling to his doom. Gosh darn it. Yeah, there is all this junk here to frickin'. Oh, man. I wish I knew about that way sooner. But you guys told me about that uh, right as I was leaving the world. Which, uh, just too bad because I would have definitely taken advantage of that sooner. Uh, where is the... I did do, um... I did do lankies here, right? Like, almost certainly. I don't know for a fact if I did lankies. I'm pretty certain I did lankies. Uh, you know what? I don't actually know what happens when I enter one of these again. Because the last time I entered one of these, I was kicked out. I'm not sure if I did lankies. Um... I'm not convinced, like, still. Which freaking sucks. I kinda wish I just had a definitive yes-no statement by God himself of this world to, to start trying to shoot me. Honestly, I'm almost positive I did this. If I didn't, like, I will come back probably with your boy Noodle Arms McJohnson. But uh, until then, freaking uh, chunky. Where is the nearest tag barrel? I'm pretty sure the nearest tag barrel is just like, uh, yeah, it's like right here, which is really convenient. And they obviously knew people would be switching off here a bunch of times over. Chunk is some coming to you, dude. I know you're gonna freak out about it, but I need you in my life, sir. Oh, Jesus. Raining down from the heavens above, it's bee shits. Uh, gosh darn it, his is all the way up there. I could shoot it from here, though. Cause like shooting it from up there is gonna be probably difficult. There it is, baby. <gasps> Slide that face down. I'm coming in, God. I really hope that... I definitely didn't do this with Chunky, right? Like, a lot, a lot inside of me is telling I did not do this as Chunky. Like, since I entered the world in the... Did it close on me? You asshole. You absolute gosh dizzily darn asshole. Oh my god, that was the most stylish entrance. <laughs> yeah, I didn't do this, right? Like, definitely not. I'm gonna go right. Gotta go right as your boy Chunkus. Excuse me, Chunkus is coming through. I feel like my legs are actually long enough to be able to- Oh shit! Climb those stairs without having to jump up them, but okay. Excuse me. Fuck off. Okay. You know what? You could, uh... You could, you could keep your life. You can't, though. Okay, yeah, you can. God damn. Why? Why? That's like one of my least favorite enemies in this. I'm pretty sure my only way to be able to kill those guys is with the oranges. And, uh, do I have to kill them? Oh god, it's looking like I have to kill them. And, uh, th they're actually bigger in the, the other world, I think. I think they might be resized in this. God damn it. Can that other one- Did the other one- Okay, I thought my other one killed the- Wait. There's a fucking door right here. <laughs> God damn it. Yeah, I definitely didn't do this as Chunky, considering this path so far has been linear, and there's just a straight-up coin for me here. Ooh. I'm gonna take those nanners, please. What? Where'd they go? Oh. Haha, <laughs> you gotta cut them off at the mystic gosh darn ruins. Preemptive orange strike, baby. <laughs> I feel like those home in a little bit. Either that or I am, I'm having pretty good luck. Oh! Something really dumb that you guys told me about is that uh, there's a move that we got from the banana fairy. Can I come back, please? <laughs> Any day now? Yeah, that doesn't kill them, which sucks. Um, there's a move that we got from the banana fairy where we have to press and hold B button? Um, I skimmed her dialogue because I'm pretty... I was almost positive that all she was going to tell me about was the camera. Why did I... <laughs> I pressed B to get out of this. Okay. All right, I'm gonna have to go closer, goddammit. Just uh, gonna inch closer. But uh, that, that B move is really helpful because it also, um... You'd think that... Really? That hurt me? How did that... Okay, what are those hitting? God damn it! Please die, dude. Thank you so much. Oh my god. The path is now open for me, basically. Yeah, can I just please have these for once in my life? Are you serious? None of those. Th 
Thank you, God. There's ammo over there, so I'll grab it on the way out, maybe. But uh, apparently that ultimate B move also uh, uncovers what the balls is under these piles. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, what the fuck? Also, what the hell is this? Dude, this is a sh frickin' disco coin. <laughs> if I've ever seen one. Oh. Hey, Chunky, that's a special coin you've picked up. It gives five coins to each Kong. Every Kong? Oh, fuck. That's really awesome. Also, I know where some are. Some others are. Actually, I think I know where one is in this world. I'm gonna go this way. This is the way that's calling me. It's- my loins are creep. Oh my god. What's up, dude? Yeah, you're gonna be a real big help in a second. I really wish I could hit one of these guys with the goddamn- What's up? Oh my god, I'm getting my ass handed to me. Just die, dude. Just die. Like, all you have to do to kill these guys is just match B in front of them, but I always try to make it more technical than it is. Yeah, please give me that. Thank you. Dude, my loins led me astray. <laughs> I'm so upset by this. It's not at all the button I should have hit, goddammit. Loins do not lead me astray once again. Yeah, I don't know what that did. Maybe my loins didn't lead me astray. Maybe this was the way that I definitely had to take because this path would have been covered up otherwise. Hello? Scussy moy. Which is definitely how you say excuse me. A scussy moy. Excuse me, Mr. B. Welcome, Welcome to, to bonus, bonus stage. stage. Kremlin Kosh, to be exact. What the fuck is this? Oh, I've played this one. This one's pretty easy if I remember correctly. Like, yeah, this is incredibly easy. Like, you basically have infinite ammo if you just let go of the stick and keep mashing A sometimes. This is... Really, game? Why is that? <laughs> what the hell? It's not hard. There are some bonus games where it's like, welcome to hell, you'll be here for five hours. And then that one's just like, ah, it's, you get a gold banana if you want it, dude. I don't know. You get to have that one. It's on the house. Why is it that <laughs> lanky noodle arms McJohnson McBoy only has one banana here? I am super not concerned. Excuse me, I'm leaving already. There's a way that I want to go that has ammo though. <laughs> Oh, Jesus. If this guy's gonna be the guy that makes me not able to leave this thing on time, I'm gonna be pissed. Yeah, I'm super not concerned I'm actually grabbing ammo on the way out. Excuse me, it's free. Thanks, I'll take it. Me. Oh my god. I don't know if this is like it in America. I know most of my viewers are um, American, and I don't know why. I think the word free jogged my memory on this story. But why is it that every time you go to fucking Taco Bell, they're like, please do the, uh, the survey on the receipt, and we'll give you a free soft taco. It's like... I know, like, and then there was one time where I, sorry, I don't know why I'm even talking about this. This is my Taco Bell tangent, for fuck's sake. It's, it's important, goddammit. Um, oh my god, I just phased right through that thing. Um, I have the banana medal as Diddy, right? I think so. Yeah, Diddy and Donkey. Um, the, the last time I went, um, the girl was like, do you know about the survey? So I was like, fuck it. She gave me an easy out here. I don't have to listen to the the rant about the soft taco. So I was like, yes, I do know about the survey. And then she was like, okay, well, listen up. <laughs> I'm like, oh, here we go. <laughs> and then she's like, um, all you got to do is say blah, blah, blah. And uh, you just say that you've done the survey, blah, blah, blah. And the next time they'll actually just give you a free soft taco. And they, they won't even question it. I was like, oh, uh, okay. And then I, I, at that moment, I actually wish I listened up. Like she said that I should do because I didn't fucking listen up. I really wish I did because uh, she was just basically telling me how to do a free soft taco. That's not exactly what she said. There was something else. Like to say you did the survey and then also to fucking do another thing. I have no, um, no recollection of what she actually said though. Which sucks because god damn it soft tacos are like easily my favorite thing at Taco Bell. Also, this is objectively true. I guess it's actually very subjective, but it's, uh, it's it's pretty uh it's pretty it's pretty obvious. If you um if you're American, um I've actually had American Taco Bell before. It is not as good as Canadian Taco Bell. And um it's uh you know that's that's obviously subjective. A lot of people will disagree, but that's fair enough, I guess. That you're entitled to your own opinion. But the ground beef that they use in America is um I want to see if I could get more health. The ground beef that they use in America is not as good, in my opinion. Like, me. 
You guys would have to definitely try American Taco Bell to be able to- Are you gonna heal my- Oh, you're gonna give me instrument? That's okay, too. Um, yeah, you guys will have to let me know if you, uh, if you've had both before, and if you've enjoyed American, let me know, because I've- Every single American I've talked to that has had Canadian Taco Bell was also like, yeah, you're right. <laughs> I'm like, alright. Um, so if this is an objective statement- Also, maybe Taco Bell has fixed their ways since, I have no idea. Anyway, I'm gonna <laughs> stop my Taco Bell rant, and instead, actually make some headway. Why do I still do the long jump, goddammit? It's inferior to the jump attack. Um, I'm gonna look around for stuff to do, and I will be right back. Coins! There's coins here for me. I'm inside, like, the one temple that you actually get tiny in. Is this where you get tiny, actually? I kind of forget. Is there a tag barrel in here also? Because that would be super helpful. Please. Wait, there's a... Where does this lead exactly? Have I swam through this before? I must have. Oh, there's stuff here for uh, Lanky. Good, good on me. I'm kind of... I think I'm actually closer to the banana metal with... Um, with Chunky here. Which is super surprising because we've actually had Lanky in this world before. Although that might, that might change in like two seconds. Is there a way to lower the water level? Because there's like a, a thing there. I don't even know what that thing is. Was that one of those beat-em-up things? Oh my god, I forgot about these things. I haven't seen one of these in so long. Yeah, I can't, I can't like hit it right now. Interesting. Oh man, there's purple coins? God dang it. <laughs> I might come back here with Tiny. Oh shit, there's something actually here for me. Thank god. I thought the path ran dry. What is this? Oh, is this just gonna lower the water? Because... I don't care. What the fuck? <laughs> ah! <laughs> Screams of the goddamn damned. Wait, wait, what? Can I? Can I have that? Can I, Can I have that? Can, can you get fucking graped already, dude? Thank you, Jesus! Is that actually- Is he gonna get, like, faster and shit? Dude, I'm not- Not even able to hit you. You gotta come out of this little radius. Gotcha, you son of a bit. Every single time that guy goes off. Oh my god, it seriously sounds like he's being frickin' murdered. Can I please? Make the hit, baby. How many times do I have to hit you? This is the ultimate final boss of the game. It just takes a while. Frickin'- Oh my god, dude. Take a grape to your beak. Grape to beak? That's my favorite kind of, uh, resuscitation. It's, uh, not a lot of people actually learn that one. When they take CPR, grape to beak resuscitation is honestly one of the- It's- it's honestly not even subjective. It's an objective- op uh, objective opinion. <laughs> Almost redundant. Thank you, Jesus Christ. Oh, I thought it landed on, like, a podium or something. Where'd that go? Oh my god. That guy needs freaking grape to beak resuscitation stats. Where did that thing go? Even? Did it go in the water? I have no idea where that banana went. Uh, oh, there it is. Thank fuck. And this is obviously for... Yeah, lanky. Getting those numbers up, baby. Oh. That lowers the water for some reason. <laughs> I thought it was going to be more technical than that. I'm going in. Welcome to Critter Carnage with a K to be edgy as fuck. Can you only do this as Lanky? I doubt it. Um, these, um, you guys told me from, like, episode one that if I'm not going for 100%, which I am not, that, uh, these are unnecessary. But I kind of want to just dip into them, at least give them a try. Because none of them so far have been hard. Oh, God. Also, notice how Lanky's final punch with both of his arms is the one that actually kills them. I kind of want to test something. Okay. <laughs> I wanted to test if, like, if I did, like, a single punch and then, like, stopped the combo and then kept coming back with a single punch if that would ever kill a guy. Probably. Wh oh my god, am I in a void? I could barely see anything. Uh, oh, the way to go is over here. Thank fuck. I finally found the path in life. Um... Those, yeah, those crowns don't actually do anything for me, do they? Little, little upsetting. Where does this go now? Is this, oh, this is where I came from? Is this where I, yeah, this is where I came from, right? Did I miss a path over here then? 
Because, like, this room opens up a little bit. A little bit? Opens up quite a little bit here. Why is there... There must have been something here that I did earlier, right, in this room? Otherwise, this doesn't really make sense. Wait, is this a different path? Oh, it is too- Where am I? Wait, I've done this before! This is actually how I've unlocked Lanky, isn't it? There are balloons for Tiny here. I don't have the, uh, the Tiny Banana Metal, do I? Okay. <gasps> this is a good way to get the Tiny Banana Metal, but unfortunately I've not seen a freaking tag barrel inside this entire thing. Um, there is one path that may still, um, have a tag barrel. So I'm willing to go check it out. Suck! <laughs> That guy didn't even know what was coming, man. Uh, there's a thing there for Chunky. Okay, I'm gonna go hit the tag barrel with Tiny and then Chunky I will come back with. Okay, I'm back. It's Tiny. This is the room, right? Yeah, you know what? I'm pretty sure... No, this is... This is the room where we unlock Tiny, actually. So why didn't we get the... Oh! Yeah, I remember now. You unlock Tiny and then she like freaking dips. She's like, yeah, I'll help you, but you know, later. Got shit to do. I've been in here forever. God damn. I need to hit up the mall to see the latest sales. And then she left. Um, she's kind of shitty, but whatever. Um, that's, that explains why these balloons are here then. Um, if I could just... <laughs> I was really hoping that it would continue on the path that it was. Hitting these things are not that hard at all, but I make it harder than it has to be for sure. Also, I got the banana medal, but I might as well just continue. So that's 13 banana medals total now. That is really awesome. God damn it. Um, I'm really happy about that. Getting up there, man. We only need 15 for the required secret surprise. I have no idea what the balls the secret surprise is going to be. Um, but I'm really excited to find out. Kind of hope it's like an ultimate move. Although, here's the thing. Wait, does this move have any... Does the hold B move have any practical purpose outside of, uh, finding shit? It's like, I'm willing to find out. It looks like it sends out, like, a pulse of death. Which is great and all, but, like... I already technically have a kill everything on screen move with the instrument. I don't get it. Maybe I'm wrong. You guys will have to correct me if I'm wrong about that. Very quick, super minor complaint about the design of this level. Um, I don't understand exactly why... Hold on, I think I might have just answered my question. <laughs> Is there no way for Donkey Kong specifically to get in this? Because I'm pretty sure... Maybe I'm wrong about this, and I think I am now that I'm thinking about it, but... Um, there is a switch for every single Kong to get in here. What, what I'm ultimately proposing is I don't understand why it is that you have to continuously open the door with your, uh, the gun. Maybe the, but like I said, maybe Donkey Kong doesn't have a way in here. Which, if that's the case, then hey man, sure. That, that makes sense then. I get that. Um, I just kind of wish there was a different way to do it. Or maybe to put the switches on the front of the, that, that's a really easy golden banana. Okay, it's not as easy as it seems, obviously. Is it like a kill everything? Because I have a plan. What's the plan? Yeah, that's... That is... That is... Oh, man! Okay, I can't actually use my instruments. Really? Yeah, I can't. That is... Incredibly odd. That... <laughs> oh, man! I wonder if I can even, then. What is happening? Oh, my God! Oh, that is cool! It's a shifty room. I fucking love shifty rooms. My favorite kind of rooms are shifty rooms. When I was younger, I actually requested that the uh, the room that I had when I was a child, God, was a shifty room. So one day I'd wake up on the ceiling and I'd be like, God damn it, shifty room. <laughs> fucking silly shifty room. Oh, classic. But then I'd miss school. And also my family was wondering how to get me off the ceiling for the longest time. And they had to send rations to the ceiling. But they had to make the rations defy gravity because I was on the fucking ceiling. The shifty room only had effect on me, if you guys aren't understanding that. Am I done? Great. Good God, I got myself a golden nurner. Mmm, delicious. The nurners of golden are delicious. I love his little claps, boys. He's got little claps, and I love them. Where's the way to leave? God, that was... Why are you back? Leave. <laughs> leave, God damn it. I'm pretty sure there's actually more for Chunky in here, right? Maybe? Also, every time I hit B now, 
Even slightly. Maybe I'm wrong. I thought every time I hit B, even slightly, it would do a... It would start to glow. Oh, there's bananas there. I love that. That's like... You guys... I've gotten that tip from multiple people. Okay, there's banana metal. Awesome. Awesome. That is awesome. I'm pretty sure there's actually more ways in here that I haven't even explored yet. Maybe I'm wrong about that, but I guess we'll see in a second. Um, Where did I think this? I thought there were like multiple doors on one of these walls. Uh... No? <laughs> Clearly I'm wrong? It's only... Yeah, this is wrong. This is all wrong! Um, I forgot what I was saying, but, but that just means it wasn't important. Um, I remember there was a time not long ago where I forgot how to swim every single time I'd play. Now I'm used to the controls in this. Um, oh yeah, that's what I was saying. Um, the, um, I'm gonna just freaking every time I jump, I'm gonna use that now. Um, the, 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 the air stall, which is what I'm gonna call it, because you're basically stalling in the air. It's not really a second jump, but it suspends you in the air and gets you even more distance. I don't think it gets you height. Yeah, it doesn't. It just gets you more distance. Hi! <laughs> Jesus Christ. Too close for comfort. Oh my god. Um, the freaking God, that guy killed himself. Yeah, I think I'm done in here now. Um, but you guys, there were many people that were like, dude, you gotta start using the air stall. And I'm like, all right, all right, I'll start using it. Now uh, now I can see why. It is like pretty pivotal, honestly, to the traversal system in this game. Um, and obviously, Rare could have easily made it so that your attack didn't suspend you in the air. Um, obviously, they realized that um, the suspension in the air was going to be part of the traversal system. Is this the... Uh, the way that I went not too long ago. Also, don't I have a, um, I intentionally used this. Are you guys proud of me? <laughs> I've almost never intentionally used these things. Um, but have I done that before? Yeah, this is the, this is the one where I weighed down the, the thing, right? Like this is the hallway that has that? Or are there multiple hallways? <laughs> oh God, I'm starting to question myself. Let me just see if this is the hallway that has the, uh, the cage. Okay, so that's definitely what that was. Uh, all right, then I'm okay for this hallway, I think. Probably. Um, I have the banana metal as everybody but Lanky, I think. In fact, I'm really lagging behind with Lanky in this world, too. I remember in Jungle Japes when I went back to that world, Lanky was like the one that was lagging behind. Or should I say lanking behind, even though I made that joke already and it wasn't funny the first time. Stop, get out of my face, you son of a bitch. Um... Yeah, there's gotta be like a path that has something good for Lanky. Or maybe all of Lanky's shit is like really in an interior for a place. Um, where is Snide's HQ in this world? Because I'm pretty sure I have some blueprints to cash in on. Let me see. Definitely for Chunky. Just Chunky. And then um, Lanky's, Lanky's um, freaking frickety frackin' blueprint is still out. In the middle of nowhere. I'm gonna switch to Lanky, just because he's the Kong that's got the most going on. And, uh, just head down this path and see if there's anything for me. Um, I'm just gonna cut ahead till there's something interesting. So, I'll see you guys then. Oh, yeah! There's a little fairy in here. Hello. I can picture you now, you son of a bitch. You son Okay, I was trying to take it for the longest time, but I was hitting the A button instead of the B button. God damn it. So, the fairies just give me, uh, my shit. Give me my shit, you son of a bitch. God damn it, I know you're holding out on me, fairy. All this time you were holding out on me, fairy. You know what's something sad that I realized is, um... I mean, it's a little upsetting. Um... The, the jump attack that I'm getting so used to now... This game and Banjo-Kazooie control so similarly. And I just realized that, um... My favorite attack in Banjo-Kazooie was the jump attack. The, the, the beak bomb. Is that what it was called? I have no idea. I, f I honestly forget. It's been so long since I played Banjo-Kazooie. Um, but I thought that a lot of my, um, knowledge from Banjo-Kazooie was gonna translate over to this. And, uh, it's just sad that that's something that I clearly forgot about. Because I would have definitely used the, uh, <laughs> the jump attack a lot more in this game. Um, if I remembered that uh, the little beak bomb move because they're so similar god damn it. Um, I've not found anything for lanky Kong But uh, I've not dove down into the water into the depths below So, you know, maybe there's something down there. Oh, yeah, okay. This is where we unlocked lanky. Please give me the 
Oh my god, this is gonna give me just enough, isn't it? Or do these give you 10? Yeah, it do, so it's gonna give me more than enough, baby! Delicious. Um, that's still really weird because I'm still not finding golden bananas for Lanky here. Like, anywhere. I'm clearly just not doing a good enough job sweeping the area, but I think I'm being pretty thorough. Like, at least it feels that way, gosh darn it. I feel like I'm being a thorough boy. Am I not being a thorough boy, gosh darn it? Oh, God. <laughs> Falling hazard, Jesus Christ. All right, I guess I'm gonna keep looking around for shit for your boy. Noodle arms. I guess a good thing to do before we move on with Chunky is uh, get the uh, golden banana for... What is... Did I say Chunky just now? I meant Lanky. I don't know what the ball stance Chunky's doing right now, but I need to see it. Show me the monk. He had his hand on his head for a second. I swear to God he did. Maybe I was just seeing things. Oh God. I've been looking around in this desert for so long. I'm starting to see, have hallucinations. I'm gonna take the last uh, little bit of this episode while I'm looking around actively with uh, ya boy Lankus Kongus. Um, I'm gonna take the last little bit of this episode to uh, ask you guys a question. Um, I did uh, talk about the fact that I'm gonna go on a trip soon. I am going on a cruise and it's gonna be really fun. Um, first off, one question. If I if I get my phone in time because I, I'm actually getting a phone upgrade I'm getting the Google Pixel 2 and it's got a really good camera and I would sort of like to do some kind of vloggy thing While I'm there on the cruise maybe like a daily cruise vlog. I don't know <laughs> Just so it feels like I don't know if I go on a vacation you guys are coming with me um, That'd be cool if I got to do something there So if you guys want to see that maybe I'll uh, maybe I'll consider doing that. Let me know if that's something you're interested in seeing um, also this is the big question. Donkey Kong 64, up to this point, has been a series with, uh, that I, that I pride myself on taking audience input and, uh, putting it into the Let's Play. For example, <laughs> that, <laughs> that jump, I would not have discovered if it wasn't for the help of you guys. Um, god damn it, this is embarrassing. <laughs> Get that thing. Um, that being said, I would need to record, I said 10 episodes, but it's not 10 exactly. It's probably more than 10, so I can... You know, be safe to not miss an upload. I would have to record 10 episodes in advance, obviously without audience input, because I'd have to do it like all in one session and just sit here for, you know, 10 times 30 minutes a piece. God, that's a long time. Bringing five hours. Just five hours of recording. Um, we hit that before? I'm not convinced that we've hit that before. Oh, wait, what does this do? Watch, we've hit this before. Also, my grapes aren't connecting. Um,. Because they're clipping through. So, what I'm ultimately trying to ask is... Oh, really? All that does is that? <laughs> God damn it, I was just in there. Um, would you guys like it if I continued recording this? Um, even though I would not be able to get your input. It would be 10 plus episodes um, without your input. I, you guys could still leave suggestions. But it would be 10 episodes without getting audience input, and I would not be able to... Again, 10 plus. There, there's probably probably more around 11 or 12 episodes that I need to record without being able to get your input. Which sucks! Why do I have exactly 23 crystal coconuts? Did she upgrade my crystal coconut count, the banana fair? I have no idea. <laughs> it's weird. I used to only be able to carry 20. It's probably... It's probably the banana fairy. Anyway, if you guys are okay with that, um, it would be 10 episodes without getting your input. Like, I can manage in the game myself. Not as well without your guys' help, but there would definitely be content filled within these episodes um, that, I, that I could be able to do without your help. Um, but that would include going to a new world, probably going to two new worlds within 10 episodes, my god. I really don't think we're gonna finish this game within 10 episodes. Um, but again, this is, this is the, this is a good bit from now. I'm not leaving for the cruise for a good bit, but I would still have to record ahead, um, very, very soon. So that's gonna go into action very soon. Let me guys, uh, let me know if that's something that you guys are okay with. If not... Then we're gonna have to decide on something. Um, there's gonna be, um, something else. I actually have something planned now. Um, I was talking about doing maybe Minecraft while I'm gone for the cruise, and a lot of people were opposed to that, and I understand why. It's kind of boring. 
there is something that I have planned that I am not gonna reveal. It's a game that came out very recently, and uh, you guys will probably enjoy it. Um, it's gonna be exactly 16 episodes for a very specific reason. If you guys know what that means, then uh, you guys have already figured out the Let's Play, which is really cool. Um, anyway, that's it for this episode. You guys will have to let me know if I could still record ahead, even though I'm not gonna be able to get your input for um, like 10 plus episodes. Um, which sucks, but that's gonna have to be the way it is if you guys want Donkey Kong It's basically do you guys want to see more Donkey Kong 64 for like 10 whole days? If not, um, I'll have to record something else and we won't record this game And it'll be on a little hiatus until I get back from the cruise. Let me know um, It's really up to you guys and I'll, I'll weigh the most popular opinion and take that into action Anyway, sorry about the rant. I probably could have compressed that s down to a couple sentences, but it was more of a rant um, that is it for this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys like this episode, please give it a like. If you guys want to subscribe to follow the remainder of Let's Play, please do so. Oh, there's coins here for Chunky. Interesting. Uh, come back next time for when we maybe get coins for Chunky. <laughs> I guess. See ya!